Well, it's been nearly 50 years since the first detected case of AIDS. But even after all these years, the virus is still spreading. And the number of new cases reported in Alabama is higher than in many other states. The Alabama Department of Public Health's recent data reports 39 new cases were detected in Montgomery County in the first six months of this year. That's the most cases in our health district and in the state. WSFA 12 News reporter Julia Avant has more on why the illness is still spreading and ways you can test and get treated. 245 people have tested positive for HIV in Alabama. According to the state health department, that's added to the more than 25,000 people currently living with the illness in Alabama alone. While cases are up in Montgomery County, Dr. West Stubblefield with ADPH says there could be more. We know that there are more cases out there that are undiagnosed, and that's concerning to us. If diagnosed, those with HIV will receive medication to manage the illness and help prevent from spreading the illness to others. Stubblefield says those not treating HIV are more likely to spread the virus most commonly through intercourse. So what we want people to know is that HIV is a manageable disease. People live with HIV and have very normal lives, but you have to know your status. Early on symptoms to look for is flu and mono-like symptoms. You may develop white sores in your mouth. Haven't been tested, there are many options in Montgomery County alone. Montgomery now has um, a fast track clinic in the Montgomery County Health Department where you can be tested for, um, for a number of different diseases and if, as long as you don't have any symptoms. Since 2020, cases nationwide of HIV have been going down. Ending the HIV epidemic in the U.S.'s goal is to reduce HIV infections by 75 percent by 2025.